is topography analysis inside PVCAD Utility Scale. So once you have uh, your layout completed, you can go over to the Topo and Reports tab. And you'll see in the first drop down we have three possible choices for topography data. We have flat site, no topography, which is just if you want to get a pure locations plan on a flat site. We have auto, which basically means you want to automatically import topography data available uh, from Google because you don't have your own site survey. And then the third option is layer, which means you have your own topography data that's already in your drawing as a layer in AutoCAD. Let's start with an example using Auto. Select that option from the drop-down list and click the Import Topo button. You'll see a cloud of topo points get automatically imported into the drawing. Now, if I select any one of these points and view its properties, you can see it has an X, Y, and a Z coordinate in three-dimensional space. It's a little hard to see in the top-down view, but if I isolate the topo cloud layer and view uh, using my 3D cube to get an isometric view, you can clearly see the outline of the Berkeley Hills where I've placed this layout, this site. Let's do another example, this time using uh, the layers feature. So I have my topography now in the layer in the drawing has contour lines. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add uh, that layer to the list of layers that, that contains um, topography information. In this case, there's actually two layers. There's the white layer and the red layer that both represent contours. So I'm going to have to go in and specify that both of those layers contain uh, contours for it to analyze. Once I've done that, I can rerun my peer analysis and again give it maximum height, minimum height, and angle. And it'll do the analysis using the topography that's available in that drawing layer.